Union, you've quickly become a big part of Leeds United's team. Um, the fact that you've been unable to train, it shows Gary's got obviously got great faith in you. That must please you. Uh, a big part is is something that that's that's your opinion. You know, maybe the gaffer might not tell you the same, um, but. I, I haven't I haven't trained to the same level as the rest of the boys. I've I've managed I've I've trained once or twice during the week. You know I've not done a full week, but you know I think most managers are similar. When things are going well, they don't really want to rock the boat too much in terms of team selection. So you know maybe on my my end I've been a little bit fortunate that I've I was in uh, a little bit fortunate that we've been winning games and. You know, ho hopefully it's the case that he doesn't want to change things because it's been going well. You're very modest. Um, you've been playing well. I mean, the injury itself, is it a pain thing or is it just restricting movement? Or what, what's it like for you? Pain. A uh, it, it, little bit of both, but the reason that I have to, to stop is the pain. It's it's more a case of, uh, it's more a case of if, I, if I had to, if when it comes on uh, I had to, chase someone or go to full speed it's it's a case of I wouldn't be able to I just couldn't couldn't do it so thankfully we've been able to up until Tuesday night we've been managing I've been getting free games only really feeling it for two three five minutes at the end so it's not been a huge issue but you know 10-15 minutes into the game on Tuesday it was there so it was a case of no chances taken and, and come off. You went off, it was uh, Ronaldo and Calvin in midfield, two young guys, they did really well, didn't they? They, they are coming <coughs> on, aren't they, those two? They are. Um, I, the last time I did, I did this before a game, you know, I spoke of how they, they, their willingness to learn, and you know, I think Tuesday night showed you that. The, the, the difference, I would say, even from when I arrived here to now, in, in them as players, and the maturity of them has, has grown hugely. So. You know, credit to them. They they went to a tough ground in front of a lot of people and, and performed to the levels that they can. And you know, they, like I said before, if it, they have big futures ahead of them if they they make the right decisions. You've been successful in the championship before, uh, and Leeds are now in that playoff mix. Are you happy where the team is at at the minute, given that you've uh, been course and distance before? Yeah, of course. It's I don't think you can complain of being in the playoffs. You know, I think even come, you know, if you're. Ninth, tenth, you won't be too far off the playoffs in January, February time, and really that's that's the business. And you know, I'd swap the position right now for to be in it in May. Uh, so it's a case of just keeping momentum going, keep winning games for us. And you know, if, if we go and lose a few, and you know, all of a sudden we slip down the table a little bit, you know, it's not the end of the world. That that's football, and, and you know, at this point we still have a lot of games left to to bring ourselves back up, but. At the moment, you know, there's there's no real downside. We're we're looking up rather than down, and and hopefully that'll continue. And, and you mentioned the support before. I mean, obviously you were aware Leeds a big club. But are you seeing now just how big they are? Full house against Newcastle. The big support everywhere you go, really. Yeah, it's the last the last few weeks that the games you mentioned, especially Newcastle and and the way at Anfield, the, the crowd was phenomenal. You know, it's although it's although you kind of tune out to the to the voices other than the ones that you need to hear on a, on a Saturday you know there's always split seconds where you know maybe there's you're, you've been down maybe they're, you're under attack or you're under the cosh for five minutes and I don't think fans realize at those moments the the amount that it does for a player to hear to hear them be encouraging and supportive and you know when it when everyone's in something together it, it becomes much easier so you know, I, all I can say in my time of being here is to, to thank them for the, the way they have responded to the team and how they have treated us over the, you know, the last number of months, and you know, hopefully it'll continue for much longer.